Hi, in this video I will demonstrate how to create a distribution board and assign circuits to it, and then create electrical schematics automatically from it. At last, I will show you the new tab called distribution boards in the model. Okay, so first let's create a distribution board. We can do it uh, by using the function distribution board, we can find any electrical toolbox in the model. But in this demonstration, I want to create it from the electrical schematics model. So I'll come to the project manager and then I will select the electrical schematics 6500. Click open. Okay, we have the same function under the schematic toolbox. To create a new board, we click on the new board button. I will give a name to this board as DB01. And to change the board type, we come to the product database by clicking on the three dots button. So I will come to the board for modular products and I will select the second uh, product on the, on the list with two rows. We see here the preview of the board. Okay. Now let's assign some circuits to, to this board. I will come to the circuit list tab and click on the new button to create the, the, the first circuit. So I'll select this supply generator type and then the, the subcategory supply with protective device with cable. Uh, we can predefine the neutral earth and also the number of phases and below predefine the, the load and the modification factor and click add to search for a fuse since we have 63 amperes selected DDS card search for these, these uh, fuses, okay? I'll select this on the list, click OK, and also the, the electrical grounding configuration. I will select this one. And then second, we select the level two protective device on bus bar. First, for, for some sockets that I will insert, I will predefine as 50 ampere. So click add and then Again, it, it searches for a fuse of 50 ampere. Click OK. Okay, now let's for the uh, installation type and I'll search for uh, socket circuits. I will predefine the load as six, 16 ampere. Um, we can also change the di diversity factor if you like, like 50%. Uh, I will add you can select the, the MCB type here. It already selected a 16 ampere uh, for the load. Click OK. Now I'll click close just to show that we can copy paste an existing circuit. So I have added here uh, four circuits, okay? Now I'll click new again, and I will select level two protective device once more, but for uh, with protective device. And now I will predefine the load as 35 ampere, okay? And reset the modification factor, click add, and then insert the fuse, come to installation type once more, and now add a light circuit. And I will predefine the load as 10 ampere, okay? Click add, select the MCB, and click close and I can copy paste multiple times. Okay, here is our list of circuits for this board. Now, if we would like to display the electrical schematics, we come to the tab sheets and then we select the, the sheets we'd like to add for this uh, schematic. So I will double click for this single man diagram. I could also select a multi man diagram. Okay, and we can also add a layout. Okay, now click OK. And the, the schematics is drawn automatically. Okay, we can go to the next page. If it's not draw everything, you, you just click on the draw circuits. Okay. So here is the, the multi-man diagram. And here we have the, the layout for, for, for the board layout. So to, to go to the distribution board layout, we come here to this working mode, distribution board layout. And we see 
the front view of this board. Okay. Now to draw the, the fuses automatically, we click on the draw symbol diagrams and we can type just F1 for the first fuse, click OK and double click and they will be entered automatically. Okay. Now I want to come back to my electrical model in the ground floor because I can go to the, to the ribbon or to the bottom of, of my model and activate the distribution board tab. In the distribution board tab, we see here the created board and indication in blue here, meaning this board is not in the model yet. If we double click this board, it just uh, display this message that it's not saved only on the model, so I'll just click OK. It can it opens my my distribution board DB01 once more. Now I'll come back to the define board and I can place the symbol in the model. And I'll insert like here. 